and we are live here for episode number one of the texas tech red raiders dynasty i know you guys have probably been waiting for this series to begin since i went through the off season with them and i know a few of you guys have went comment on the video or on the stream and i know a lot of people just been excited for this series to start and I'm basically about to begin it so i haven't really played much in C this last stream. All right. Bring this over here, my phone. So, I already went through a little bit of the recruiting off stream. I forget who I play first. I think it's LSU. It is indeed LSU at LSU. Today's stream is more than likely going to be a one game stream. If you guys come into the chat or if you watch this as a video, like you probably could tell from how long it would be. But today is going to be a one game stream. Just because, I don't know, I, I just feel like I don't, like I don't want to burn myself out, I don't want to play like two, three games, which I probably have a few days like that, but I don't know right now, I, I just feel like right now I want to do a one game stream, still recovering from my nine hour stream that I did the other day playing Call of Duty all day. Yo, what's up, Jaden? Oh man, let's use number five now. Pretty much no LSU's team. Honestly, I didn't check see who they all got from the recruiting class that I built up. I want to go through and just check. See. All right, so Noah is a 99 overall. Stephen Wall is a 90 already. Look at how OP that team would have been for next season. Jameer Bird stay for his senior year. Ryan Hearing's probably not even gonna get start, and he won the he won the Heisman. Look at it. That's what his stats was with me, and don't even get to see how he progresses throughout his freshman. What about the receivers? Danny Smith stayed. Oh, dude. He's gonna be... Dude, this team is gonna be a problem. This is the team that I built up, dude. Harry Doyle, dude. He was one of those linebackers I was super excited to play with, and he didn't disappoint me either. Like, look at the stats he had. He had four sacks. He had a forced fumble. Coming off the edge. David Henry. Ooh, I didn't play with him. At Darby, though, I played with him a decent amount. He had an interception, two pass deflections, two defensive touchdowns. Three fumble recoveries. Look at the corners, dude. The trio right there. And they stacked up more.
marker, right? Harrison Crowder? I don't remember him. LSU is also on a pretty big win streak at home. They are on a 20 game win streak at their home stadium. Pretty much what I built up for them. Look at the overall they would have. They have a 99 across the board now. And that's the team that I pretty much built up for them. So now we get to go against them and see how good LSU truly is. All right, so we're going to wear. We're going to give LSU their. Oh, dude, we're going to go black. All right. Okay, I'm not going to lie. Oh yeah, I need to change. I think uh, it was um, whoever the rapper ten thousand said that Texas Tech plays in a three three five defense. I don't know if that's true or not, but I'm gonna put that as our defense. I've never used it before. I don't know how overpowered it is, but I'm gonna go with it. Because my first year, I want to use everything Texas Tech, and then I want to build off of that. And then uh, for the offense, after the first year, it'll be random playbook again. For our offense, defense, I'll probably use a three-three-five for a bit. Hopefully my controller don't die, and I don't have to grab the other charger. Then let it charge on this other cord for too long. I think this other cord is kind of messed up because it only... I don't know, dude, it don't make sense. It plays it, but it don't charge the controllers. All right. Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 um, pregame show presented by Nissan. Okay, LSU is going with their purple jerseys. The mist starts to rise off the Mississippi Did not River put and starts rolling black and white. Tiger Stadium. There's nothing quite like a football game in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The players are starting to feel that it. energy. The crowd has been alive for hours. I think I'm and we are now, closing but... in on kickoff from Baton Rouge. That does it for us here on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Enjoy the game. We'll see you at the half. But we'll just keep it. You know, I would want LSU to wear their white jerseys, but they're going to go with the purple one. The kickers got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. And he got all of Let's this get one. this underway. He's to the 20. He wasn't breaking that tackle. What a hit. The Tigers have a new head man. New theories, new hopes, new dreams. Kendall Bryles. We'll Bryles coaching his first game at LSU. Yo, what the heck is this? The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. I need some big boys if I'm playing this defense. Oh my God. Look at Jameer Bird just going to run over us. And the defense gives up some free yards to the offense. Uh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. Dude, 
Dude, like we're not even we're facing against people that played on the bench on the last year. He's at the 40. Oh my god, Noah Herbert. Tackle made at the 21. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive. Yo, why does Noah this remind me of right Joe now. Burrow right now? This is their third first down. They're doing Not being the fastest quarterback, but want. also has a and little bit of really speed. Got to get psyche of this defense down. Oh my god, Antonio Brooks, you're not catching him. It's away from him. Yep. Touchdown. Yep. Nail it. Great call by the offensive coordinator. Big time play, taking that ball all the way in. Maybe the defense wasn't expecting a run. That right there was under a minute to LSU is up Happy Memorial six. Day back to you, Brady. Hope you're having a good day Let's so far. Now from Reese Davis. The Yellow Jackets came into the game ranked eight. A hard fought game. How high can they stay in the pole? This one was tight. Campbell looks ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Stepping up. Throws quickly and it's almost intercepted. Oh my god, he underthrew that so like bad. That. Good effort by the defender. From their own I wouldn't expect too line. much out of this game against Second LSU. Down. Oh crap. And this one could be on the defense. Intentional grounding. I'd rather... Oh, wait. Pass interference. Oh, it is on us. I couldn't hear it. Little stumbles like these can Still kill your hand. offensive progress. So if it's not intentional ground and we got a pass interference. <laughs> oh, man. We are not in a good position now. It's second and long. Ball on the 15-yard line. Tries to thread the needle and it's not going to work. Wow. LSU up seven points. He laterals the ball. Inside oh the 10, my and he goodness, dude! Bounds, right around the 10-yard line. You know, I love this offensive coordinator. I've always really appreciated his approach to the game. But he's a little bit unorthodox in his approach, and this time he gives the wide receiver a chance to carry the football to pick up a first down. Now was back to pass again. Going to throw <gasps> to the end zone interception. No exactly makes a mistake. Kind of you want to see from a safety. He needs to be able to read the play and then make the interception. Let's go, Archie. From their own 20-yard line, first down. And they get him okay. in the backfield for a loss. The defense was just all over that play. It didn't fool anybody. He's 
taken down at the 16 yard line. Gain of one for Chase Young now. Dude, we're about to get stomped. From their own 16 yard line, it's third down. They're one of the loudest crowds in the country, and they are on their feet. Throws it out, knocked loose. Allen was the intended target on the play. So they couldn't pick up the long yardage, and now they'll have to punt. On third down, the defense was expected. The first the pass. pass was underthrown, should have been picked. Well second, the second pass was pretty much is dropped by Douglas. The third pass was dropped. Calls for the fair catch. Well, let's see if he can shake off that pick that he tossed last time out. And I don't think this defense will lay down lightly. They're going to try to continue to rattle this guy. LSU is up seven. There he goes. He's at midfield. And down he goes at the 37. Okay. Our... They might be coming here. Let's go get that sack on Noah. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Three down, three down. Watch 14, watch 14. He's at the 30. He gets to about the 27-yard line. Dang, dude, a big gaping hole for Jameer Bird up the middle. Three down, three down. Play 56, play 56. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. And they gain of the zero, but they the give him down. the first Nothing down. Too fancy here. The key is that the running back was able to convert the first down. quickly to the tight end he's still moving inside the 10 touchdown Tigers how do they let the tight end get so open on such a big play that was poor defense looks like there was some miscommunication between the safety and the linebackers which caused for him to get so open he splits the uprights with the extra point Let's get an update now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese, time to go to the Little Apple in Manhattan. And Old Moses, Dominion beat Kansas he up State. Terrific numbers with four touchdown passes. Fourteen to nothing in this one, Reese. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the twenty. Across the thirty. And he's tackled at the 34-yard line. Nice return LSU's by Lionel Archie. All over the field. You have negative four Boy, yards sure on the offense right now. We're right just now. seeing great defensive effort. They have a plan. They understand it. They're playing with great speed, and they're not giving up big plays. That's why they're playing well up to this point. Their last drive ended in a punch, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. Gains his way to the 43-yard line. They go with a run, and that'll be hey, a game Chase of nine. Young. Chase, Chase Young get a few carries. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. And he's taken down at the 44. Oh, my God, dude. Only a gain of, a gain of one, but we get... We still got to get another yard. These fans are showing you why teams <laughs> hate to come here, folks. Brought down Let's go about get the that first. Seven yard line. They played it pretty carefully, going with the run in a short yardage situation, and it paid off. Hey. 
It's first and ten. Ball on their own 47. Quick throw to the tight end. He steps out at the 50. I was nervous on that, dude. Coaches, we've talked to his teammates. Everybody says this kid's a real deal. We're about ready to find out. Dumps it complete to the halfback over the middle. They'll bring him down at the 40-yard line. Here's the true test of a quarterback at any level. Can they make a good throw under pressure when one or two or three guys are coming right at him? I think this young passer has proven that, yes, he can. First down, 10 to go. Ball oh, let's get open on the field, buddy. Play action. He Douglas. Wants it all. Can't make he drops it. Oh my god. Gets to about the 37 yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. I can't believe it. And Douglas. The crowd really making it difficult. Steps up. Crosses to the running back and he pulls in another one. And he tackles him hard at the 29. From the 29 yard line, it's first down. Nice run up the middle. Carry by RJ Slaughter. That'll make it second and four. Offensive line is starting to get tired. This is the tenth play of this drive. Roger, Roger. Come on, Peterson, get open on that slant. Oh, Finds his let's go, Brian Allen. the extra point a 10 play 65 yard drive and a touchdown as a result Brad I thought that was a textbook drive I thought they did a really good job of showing balance mixing the play calling with the run in the pass just an overall well executed touchdown drive from his own goal line he's to the 20 he gets out to about the 25 yard line So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. LSU is up by a touchdown. Throws it Ooh, out and it falls in for the middle. their own 25 yard line it's second down he's on the run the mayor bird Tackle dude at the 44 yard line oh I can't believe that the game will not play what's his face because his overall is not higher than his. Looks to the back and can't Ooh, that was going right to Paul White.
third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Another face mask. Lionel Archie. Right now. There. The coaches will be giving him an earful for it, too. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 26. LSU is up a score. Oh, oh. Archie almost had it again, dude. I was forcing it a lot. And they make the stop at the 30. And here's another third down. <laughs> Hopefully we can hold him here. He's in trouble. And he might want it all here and does. Antonio he Brooks, dude. What a play. the second catch for six he's registered today you know this guy is such a difficult target to cover in the passing game it usually doesn't matter who's covering him he always seems to find a way to get open and make a catch and he hits the pat a seven play 66 yard drive and they add seven points to the scoreboard. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. They line up to kick this one away. He just drills this Dang, one. man. This one's going to be down Have at least two plays we could add this a turnover. Kind of game. We're getting a chance Stead to see turn. so many touchdowns. The I just LSU wonder if this enough. offense could continue to flow. Another 14-point lead. Three series. They need to show a little giddy up now because if they don't start eating into this deficit, they could easily fall out of the game. That's right through his it. hands. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25 yard line. Young takes the give, and the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Let it run down to the end of the first quarter. LSU put up a fast start going up 21 to seven. Hoping that my uh, receiving core gets better throughout the year. A long way yet to go, but at the end of one, hopefully, Tigers a few years, we'll be in a good spot. This team. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Becoming the 12th man, the crowd is always into it here. Quick throw. There we That's go, Douglas. At the 46. And Frank a nice Douglas. pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. From their own 46-yard line. First down. 
up the middle for a nice game. Young picks up about four yards on the play. That makes it second and six. complete he's got space to work tackle made at the 42 gain of eight yards first down from the 42 yard line first down It out. That is a great call and a big yards. gain, especially on an early down. Tackled after a decent pickup. Kinley Boyd. I have to mix up some different plays. This is the eighth play of this drive. Larry, Larry. Stand up. 91 is the mic. Stand up. Passes and it's almost picked off. Craig Marshall. That huge sign of relief because he got away with throwing what should have been an interception. Third down again. Makes it out to about the 20. The defense is having a difficult time stopping this drive. Right now, they're doing enough to be in situations they want to be in, but they have to finish the job. And the plays start to add up, so we'll have to see if this defense starts to look tired out there. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Hey, watch that, watch that. Check right 64. Right 64. Ooh, can Allen break off a of Dan Collins on the outside? Oh no, he can't. And Nobody. Oh, actually, X was open. In college football, just pins his ears back and has again that extra instinct to know when to jump the snap count, when to take a chance on third down. And it seems like they almost save their extra pass rush and extra incentive as far as their their energy when it really <laughs> matters on a third down when they feel like they can beat that offensive tackle. Also, a bad thing is on that sack. I don't know how good our That's kicker something is. That's I think we've seen him do throughout this game. They'll go with a run once again. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. Third down and 18. <laughs> they line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. Taken down at the 28 yard line. Think of nothing. Hit this. Oh, goal. The kick oh. is up. And he nails Got the it. Long field goal. Barely. How far was it? Oh, man. The Red Raiders had one of their key guys go down earlier, but it looks like he might be able to return. Texas Tech to kick. It's fielded at the two. He's tackled at the 29-yard line. Ooh. Knocked out. We'll, we'll keep him out. We'll keep him out. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. Gets it. He's in space. Stars. He's knocked out of bounds. The 39-yard line. Good 
go. That is their first completion. That is not a touchdown. Runs it left for a decent game. That's good for a gain of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. Goes with a read option. And he's tackled at the 48. Short of the first. That's a fumble. Three. No. If, the, if it is, do gets the first. And down he goes at the 43. The I would pop to say if he gets that first down. Yeah, they tried to get a little bit too fancy there on that option play. Where to punt. He really got a hold of that one. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. It was a pretty <laughs> one side right, first so quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things change in a big way first before halftime. Where's the pass from Brent Douglas? Double juke inside. At the 36 yard line. That was a good reaction to the blitzing linebacker. That's what you like to see out of a young quarterback. He just has to John ignore the pressure John. and get the ball out of there on time. From their own 36 yard line. It's first down. But off to Douglas Breakout again. To receiver. And he shoved out of bounds at about the 45. Yo, what's up, the rapper 10,000? Alright, Boyd is back in after his getting his win knocked out of him. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Let's go with the PA read on the First other side. Two. Ball on the 48. Fires across the middle, and he's taken down. Lorenzo Strickland finally gets his first catch of the new year. Shallow cross. Ball on the 38. It's a fumble. And the defense is on it. I was looking for the wheel route, waiting for him to turn up field, and I got sacked and fumbled. Quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field. And I didn't even see that dude blitzing. They'll bring him down at the 47. A bear comes away with two yards on the quarterback keeper. You're not going to be able to get by a sure tackler like this linebacker too often. Second and nine. Ball on the 47 yard line. Would throw it short Sends again. It nice. 
down right around the 48 yard line drop back a yard so he loses a yard but fooled at all but the it's still third down and nine when it was third or second down and nine There we go. Get that stop. Quickly. I'd say that went about as well as the defense hoped it would. The Red Raiders will use their first time out of the half. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. Booming kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. We gotta go 80 yards to at least get in. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Probably gonna get to about the 30 yard line to get a field goal. Here we go. Setting up blockers or running backs got it on the screen. And he is drilled at the 39. Oh, so young. The strike complete, and he hits him hard at the 46 yard Brian line. Brian Allen. That'll bring up second and three. He wants it all. No, Harrison Crowder. need about three yards to get the first down here on third down the crowd of this stadium always a factor in a football game fires quick out to the Douglas receiver and drops it again this is a great punt oh, team. it looks dude. like they're going to try to get to this one for the fair catch well, the tiger staff right now has got to be smiling because what they're putting out on the field is working against so this far defense. i've counted battle three this drops this offense. we thought the quarterback might be the one to be able just to make from some big douglas plays today, but up to this point it's been the running game not a lot of success for this offense on their last trip out fires out quickly to the tailback tackle at the 27. out to his wideout. He's tackled at the 37-yard line. Well, we've played a half of football. The Tigers. All right, so after the first half, we're down 21 to 10. Defense playing. Glad to have you with us in the studio decent. for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 halftime show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. These teams only play one game a week, only 12 games in a normal regular season. I think fans have a hard time understanding why their squad can come out and play without any energy, any emotion. Keep it real with us. Tell us what it's like. Why is it hard for a player sometimes in a game like this? Well, if the fans showed the same emotion, then maybe we would too as a player because think about it. When I walk out there and I'm playing one of the big dogs, the stadium's rocking. 
they're, LSU they're has crazy. They're had the ball ballistic. for five minutes they're and 49 hydrated. You know seconds. Exactly what's going on. They're into they it. have They've been tailgating for hours. literally well, outnumbered at our yards. They don't get as excited. They're not... All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. LSU's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back can at least the make this a four-point game if we can get a touchdown on this drive. Quick throw out to the receiver. And that's what we were talking about earlier. Absolutely. Nice pass play here. The quarterback shows some guts here throwing this one into coverage. <coughs> Hopefully we can, uh, and again, great timing on the throw. Stay alive. Stay alive and win this game. I don't think we'll win it, but I think we can keep it close. It's first and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. Open field. So they pick up quite Check a few my status. Out to decide which players are sub out to make them stronger. Well, normally the players that get super tired is the offensive line. Right now, the tight end is starting to get tired, but the next best tight end is like a 62 overall, so it wouldn't make a difference. Peterson would still be better than him, so I already know there. Out to his receiver, and they make the stop at the 41. And then my problem is, is eventually I'll just start forgetting to go sub people out like that. I wish I knew like a good uh, auto sub. Pressure coming, and he throws it away. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Stepping up. Quick strike and he drops it. Oh my god, dude. Brent Douglas. Oh my goodness. Seventy five is starting to get tired. I feel like hopefully in a new if they ever make a new NC game, they can make it where you can just sub people out on the fly, dude, because it's too much of a hassle to pause it, go sub out somebody. Let him play for a Moves few plays, go sub out somebody else. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. That's a first down. That's first down. Complete breakdown in judgment. <laughs> These are the types of mental errors that drive coaches crazy. Peterson is starting to get exhausted. From the 22 yard line. First down. He's on the run, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. Brett Hills. What's crazy is Peterson got open going over the middle. I just seen it late, and I was already rolling to the right. From the 24-yard line, second down. Ooh. On the ground, left side. Go Inside Young. The 10. Touchdown, Red Let's Raiders. go, Chase Young. And he hits the PAT. 
nice seven play, 72 yard drive. And a touchdown as a result. Brad, how about the guys up front? The offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw. So our score, 21 17. Turner has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. Make this a four point game. And he's taken down at the 26. But now. Our, well, our defense play in the second half. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. LSU is up by four. Completes it and he's hit hard immediately. Makes the catch and he's got nowhere to go. Okay, LSU's not uh, trusting Noah Herbert's arm right now. Oh my Tackle God, Danny Smith! Line. That gives him the team's all-time mark for receiving yards. Good for him. He's always been a fierce competitor and a great talent. And every time he makes a catch, there's a chance he could do something big. Oh my God, Herbert's running over our defense. been stopped short down here the last two trips. Taking out in two, Herbert's gonna run, and he's he gets the first down. down. About the 11. Oh, man. Herbert's Just gonna throw it away. Great job by the defense of getting after Yeah, I love how Danny right Smith. Now, I think they've got him with some what I used to do with him. To be a bit rattled. Oh, and I saw about number 39. Oh, okay, never mind. 52. Dude, you can't sub anybody out besides the defensive line. Line. Okay, it's second down. You can sub out the defensive line, but you can't sub out cornerbacks. Looks quick to his Ooh, tight end and he can't Richardson's hang on. going to drop that one. This is the eighth play of this drive. Archie. Blitz off this edge. Throw the screen bird. That's a touchdown. touchdown LSU. And for Abair, he's having a great game with four touchdown passes. Well, he's shown such great poise back there in the pocket. That's the main reason he's been able to find the end zone so many times. And he tacks on the extra point. like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Oh no, I can't take a knee. This dude's exhausted. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 23 yard line. And he's hurt. Come on, Archie. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. And it was a really nice drive, too, Brad. The quarterback got into a nice rhythm and did a good job of picking apart the defense. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. From their own 23-yard line. 
Archie sprained his ankle, but he will return soon. Game with that injury earlier, and the sooner he gets back, the better, because they've been really working over his backup. Peterson over the middle. He's hit, completes. He's brought down in the open field. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get Ooh, enough pressure we'll keep on the Archie out, dude. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. McKinley Boyd, he's having a decent game so far. And he's tackled at the 42. Young gains about two yards on the run. Ace Young. From their own 42 yard line, second down. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked oh, off. Oh, dude, I didn't think Derek Harrison was going to stick with him like that. As an anticipation throw. And this crowd is going absolutely crazy. Throws it. Picked off. Oh, dude. And, there isn't anyone and that's going to be a pick six. He's got an that's opening. if Douglas can catch him, and he does at the like one. This corner's ability to read the play. He shows very good football smarts and pretty good hands, too. That was a good throw. Because Harrison has a lot of speed. It's first down. So inside the five with a first and goal. And it looks like they're going to bring some heat. Touchdown, oh, bird Tigers. up the middle. Touchdown, GG's. And he converts the extra point. Campbell gets set to kick this one away. This right here would be and a miracle comeback. This one. Great kick. He's to the 10. And he just got drilled. I'm sure the quarterback would love to make amends for that last pick. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. And down he goes. Right around the 20. The back gets three on the carry. Ooh, I end up having to call a timeout, get everybody fresh. It's second down, eight to go. Then will that timeout even help line. anybody? Oh, a big dude. Hit and he'll lose yardage. into this place passes to the wide out and he can't pull it in another drop and I think Peterson's hurt dude we've had three injuries this game two of them been, will return soon but how bad is Peterson going to be because that was a hit yardage on the run back the quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play the Red Raiders tight end down there on the sideline he's such a key ingredient in their offense both in the running game and the passing game and hopefully he'll be able to get back in this ball game got a man but he's tackled back behind the line of scrimmage and they back up three yards on that play. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be Shoulder sure of that. Shoulder strain. From the 47-yard line, 
It's second down. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He gets hit out of bounds at the 35-yard line. I'm trying to catch Antonio Brooks is I'm impressed with the poise pretty much impossible. I know how it is to use him. To keep his concentration and get his hands on the football. There's Jameer Bird up the middle. the 33-yard line. Never really had a shot. They were on him almost as soon as he took the handoff. It's second and 13. Ball on the 36 yard line. He's going to try and scramble. Just look They'll at that, dude. They got the 23. I understand that was my defensive line, so I was up in a nickel package. But Jesus, man, these guys should be a little bit tired. They try the right side. He makes it out to maybe the 23 yard line. By the time the running back here got the football, he's looking up and he's got a couple defensive linemen closing in on him because they were able to slip off of their blocks. Really, is nothing he could do at all there. That was more of a miscommunication and just getting overmatched up front by the offensive line. Straight run, and he's brought down in the backfield. That is a loss of three yards. That'll make it third and 13. And so it's another third down upcoming here. Throws in the middle. Tackle at the 28. And they lose a couple there. They really hey, at least we got the stop on them. Room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. Flags are all over the place and they'll blow it. I'm pushing him back, but uh, now what? Maybe he got don't the matter. cadence wrong coming out of the huddle. The coaches have a low threshold for mistakes like that. Fourth down and a ways to go after the penalty. Kicks away. Campbell misses no the field goal? The wow, right. dude, he actually has a... I know his stats are his overall. He has good accuracy. It was a quick three and out on their last possession. Down two possessions. Be this offense a difficult has to task to come back, but on this possession. We'll need a few big plays He's out of this team. The 36. Three yard gain by the running back. That'll make it second and seven. Maybe it's time to get the backup some experience as we head to the fourth quarter. LSU's up by 18. Dude, like, look at that throw. That was a good throw. But that was just a better defensive play. Welcome back to the action here as we resume. We need that next four. Patrick Mahomes on this team. Steps up in the pocket. Fires out quickly to the tailback. Brought down at the 48 yard line. Might have to take a timeout at some point. Might have to up in this fourth quarter, man. It's first and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. But I know the team I built up with LSU, do they are pretty 
They're pretty good now. Quick pass. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Peterson. And it. I knew it would happen. All right. Stop. At the 34 now we're good. Peterson's tired already too. First and ten. Let's try to take this deep pass. Uh, Douglas here. Who was that open over the middle? Was that Peterson? They got to the quarterback and back. It looked like deep. they had a chance to bring him down for the sack. But somehow he's able to throw the ball away. He is what he wants. He is what he wants. Oh, dude. There's a strike complete. Strickland Tackle beats that coverage. Got to take a timeout now. Let's see the team. Oh. Let's run it one time and then we might have to take a time out depending on how good this run is. Nice run up the middle. Dang, dude. In a four. That makes it second and six. I and just feel like burning a timeout Lebron. now would pretty much be useless, but we also need a score. The 10, and he hits him hard at the 10. That's a game of seven on the play. That makes it there we go. Goal. Oh, I know. Huddle there. He's scrambling. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmaker. Oh, dude, the whole offensive line is tired. Oh, dude, we're Texas burning Tech one. Just took their first time out. Yo, that didn't even get everybody. Okay. Okay. From the 10 yard line. Second that only down. helped a few people, not everybody. Um, Peterson, this is your play. This is not your play, it is your play. Touchdown. Texas Tech's been telling anybody that would listen that this kid really has what it takes to be a star. And he's always going to remember that first touchdown. I'm sure he's going to have a lot more. Great moment, though, for him and his family. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Let's get the latest now from Reese Davis. The Spartans roll into today's game. Michigan number State six versus in the Miami. This Miami. Been entertaining us all day Unranked long. Unranked Michigan, Michigan State's State, number six. They've managed to make some noise with their passing game. They get into the end zone for a touchdown. So we got Turner six minutes. As his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick now. this one off. 
Collins from the four. Tackle made at the 28-yard line. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Zips it to the back. He's taken down at the 37-yard line. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. There goes Jameer Bird. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on their own 49. There goes Carl Benjamin now, breaking tackles. Tackle at the 45. Call it a gain of six yards. Third down. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. Mike 56, Mike 56. Quick pass, man open, and he dropped it. Number 87 was the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up fourth and five. We got that stop. In a perfect world, he knocks this kick down inside the 10. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. All right, so... Gotta go 80 the yards. The offense will be hoping they can move the ball as well as right they on. did on their last drive. Make this a one possession game. And a quick throw. And he's tackled at about the 29 yard line. Boyd with a nice throw. That brings up second and one. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Douglas with a catch over the middle. Around the 38 yard line. Start going no huddle a little bit. Slings it. Ooh, Douglas again. Around the 49 yard line. This patient throw He's to Peterson out gets out of bounds. The 36 yard line. That's a gain of 15 on the play. First and 10. From the 36 yard line. First down. Receivers got it on the screen. They'll bring him down around the 24 yard Allen. line. Call it a gain of 12 yards. First down. He launches one for the end Good zone. Good job to the end zone. Touchdown, Red Raiders. Makes the catch, Lorenzo Strickland.
and he hits the PAT. Here's an update from the studio and Reese Davis. The Spartans came into the game ranked sixth. After that performance, they're going to fall like Wiley Coyote off a cliff. This game was tighter than spandex on a sumo wrestler. Texas Tech gets set to kick this one away. Benjamin deep to return. Benjamin from the two. He makes it out to maybe the 23 yard line. The Tigers star player oh can walk around campus happy all week, even though he's not God, that the right there was a play. play. He didn't put up big numbers, but he recognized the defense trying to spend so much time taking I was you right game here on the this offense. Verge. By recognizing that, he's been able to utilize Losing. this running game, and it's been the difference in the football game. LSU is up four. He might not be able to get the pass off. And he's level. Or Herbert sack. They're winding down the clock now. Get this stop, we'll call it. Last two timeouts. Oh, Danny Smith. Oh, if that were right there was a streak. Danny Smith, that was a touchdown. Timeout, that's their second of the half. They're about four yards away here. But that's me in real life. If I'm Danny Smith and I would get off that line that fast, dude, I'm running straight down the field. Antonio Brooks this isn't first even the best down. example, but I'm gonna tell you something. This young man is really getting better at running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. Tackle right around midfield. Uh, that might <laughs> that might have just been the dagger. We have one timeout. I get this first down, it's GG, and I'll just call on timeout so they can do it. LSU should pass to the running back. Well, I can't control what the CPU does. They go to the screen here, and the halfback's got it. He's tackled around the 42-yard line. No, man, that's going to be so GG, but I'm going to just use this last timeout so they can just and stop throwing and they can maybe take their knees and end the game. From the 42-yard line, it's first down. Nope, they're not going to take just it yet. Just over a minute left. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Dang, dude, we made that run at the end. Still a chance that they uh three down, three down. Mike 56, Mike 56. keep running the ball. He gets out to Imagine he fumbles right there. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 32. And that's gonna do it, man. So this one's in the books, and we saw a great one here today. LSU 35, Texas Tech 31. Noah Herbert put up some. Thanks for joining us. Put up some decent stats there. Football 14 for Kirk and everyone here at oh, man. We made... saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time. I think we dropped the ball at least seven, eight times this game.
and we still only lost by four too. Check out the stats. I gotta see how many times we dropped it. John Young had to come in for two plays because McKinley, McKinley Boyd ended up getting hurt. And threw two for two, 25 yards. McKinley Boyd had 306 yards, three touchdowns, two interceptions, which, to be fair, that's like a, a Big 12 team right there. LSU played it slow. They threw it to their running back a lot. They didn't pass the ball deep like we normally played it. Noah Herbert wasn't the quarterback that I used for mine when I played there. But he did play a few games, but not a lot. Chase Young, he had 16 carries for 73 yards. He is our best running back. Bobby Guerrero is our fullback. And I don't know if I enjoy having him as our second running back especially playing up in an air to air raid offense receivers look at all the drops five there and then six i said eight i thought i don't know if they counted the one that he dropped early in the game but that's a pretty <laughs> good stat five 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 seven eight LSU though, let's see them. They threw it to their running back a lot. Ricky Richardson, Antonio Brooks. I knew he was gonna be a problem for us. Danny Smith only caught one pass. Ken Starks, a guy that I was excited to use. Nate Grigsby, also a dude that I was excited to play with, but didn't get the chance because of all the other talent. And now we moved on to Texas Tech. And then the defensive side. Lorenzo, or not Lorenzo, Lionel Archie had our only turnover for us. Actually, it wasn't our only turnover. They, uh, we had a forced fumble by Mike Wilson. We recovered it also. I, did we? No, we didn't, actually. We didn't. It was on a third down. I was saying if they got that first down on fourth down, I would have been mad. But this play right here, I went crazy over it. Look at the tight coverage Craig Marshall has. This is literally right on him the whole way. And look at Lorenzo. That's like a perfect pass out to him. Grab that thumbnail real quick. So after I go back to the main menu, I'm going to end the stream. Probably take about a 15, 20 minute break. Get some food and then I'm going to be playing some Call of Duty with one of my friends. It's not going to be a super long night. It'd probably be like an hour, maybe an hour and a half, two hours. I'm not sure. Probably not even two hours. But. Hoagie almost pulls off a big upset with Texas Tech, but falls short. Yes, we did. We fell short that goal. I think this team should be. I think this team should be happy with what happened. But, alright guys, I'm going to end the stream right here. Up in the next stream, we're going to pick up recruiting. Probably scout a few more people and do stuff like that. That's going to be at the start of the stream. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the Texas Tech Red Raiders Dynasty for episode number one. Episode number two will either be tomorrow or Wednesday. I'm not sure yet. 
but I think this series is gonna help me get back into NC a little bit more play it and hopefully the teams in the Big 12 give out a good competition even with LSU I played against Texas they gave good fights Oklahoma they gave good fights against LSU and you seen what they did to me it was a 35-31 game but Texas Tech is also an offensive team but not in this series so far they haven't been an offensive team but hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like on the video subscribe for some more of the Texas Tech Red Raiders dynasty weird saying that instead of LSU Tiger or LSU dynasty but until next time guys I'll see y'all later peace out